In this video I'm going to explain how to add the Ajax full address lookup to your web page. Effectively you can easily access the information I'm about to show you from the go back to menu button at the bottom of this video. That will take you back to a web page and on there are three links which explain the three different types of integration methods using .NET, PHP or Classic ASP. But essentially the three different methods are the same or similar. So I'm just going to show you here using PHP and having clicked on that link it takes me to this page here which has a demo um, simple form but if we scroll down it says here we've got seven easy steps to integrate into our form and obviously step one is it downloading the example code we then add a reference to various sections of our web page and add some styles to that page place the div where we want the um, address lookup list to appear and then we alter some JavaScript which actually maps what address fields go to um, each individual field on our form. So really it's done relatively simply and easily customizable so I'm just going to go to the download code so having downloaded the code you will find in that, co in that download a directory called Ajax PHP full address lookup that contains several files to add to your website the index HTML is a simple example of um, this address lookup which we'll be working on in a second the first thing we need to do is open these files in a text editor and you'll see here the two PHP files it says here put your data key now we need to paste in our data key which will have been sent to you via email when you opened um, the account with us if you've lost that then just simply log into your account and it's listed under the data keys tab of your online account now note it's got a W in front of it this denotes that it's for web use and we do issue another data key with an I in front of it which is for internal use web use basically means for public access uh, internal use basically means employees of your company so if you're using address lookup within your company for your employees you must use the I data key which then means that we track the number of users actually accessing the system thus the internal use is um, licensed per user web use is per click so we would then publish that to our website and as I said it includes that index HTML which looks like this a very simple example I'm just going to hit the find button on an address and you can see there that the Ajax has actually squirted in this list box here now that is actually squirted in let me just find the section here into um, a div section so essentially you define a div on your web page which denotes where this is going to be written to um, using various styles this style section here so you have some control over the style of that list box it then calls um, some JavaScript when you've obviously pressed the find button or select to write back the address information and as I said at the bottom here it does actually mention that in the JavaScript are these various lines here used to map the, in, the actual address line information back to the fields within your form so it's just a simple case of editing this JavaScript I think it's at the bottom here to alter the behavior and the mappings uh, of the address data.